Hey guys, it's Chris here from the Tech Geek channel and welcome back to another video of Windows 10. Here we go! So in this video, we're going to talk about Windows 10 Mobile Bill 10586.36. Now, if you ask me how is there another build after the official RTM build, then my answer is that it's the official third try from Microsoft at building the perfect build. Now from the looks of it, it looks quite good. It is actually in pretty good shape. So let's go ahead and unlock the phone. And here we are presented with the Windows Hero Start screen. Now from normal usage, um, what I can only tell is that this build is actually working perfect, unlike the other builds that were also working perfect, like the letter switching, the switching actually works pretty good, and the tactile feedback is also very good. So why release another build when everything was perfect? Well, the answer is everything was not perfect. So the first pretty example of why everything was not perfect is the camera app. So the camera has opened up and if I just pick up the phone and you can um, watch it. And by the way, I am recording this video with another Lumia, if you can see it through the, this Lumia screen. And that is the Lumia 640XL. But what I wanted to show you is that how sluggish and slow the camera app is. It is quite out of focus normally. You always have to keep tap to focus, unlike this one, which automatically focuses. And also, the video recording in which I could automatically focus is gone. Yes, it is gone. And there is a clear difference between the Lumia camera and the Windows camera app. It's just not a slight difference, it's a clear difference. For example, see how out of focus this is. Now, if I tap to focus, it might get clear. And it is clear. but. Whenever I am, I just don't tap to focus, it's out of focus. So, that is a pretty bad thing. Another thing that is gone is living images. I hate this camera app. This is the worst of all. Like, if I go into settings, there is no option for living images. Press and hold, you get a video, photo burst, or disabled option. No framing grids, uh, I mean there is framing grids but uh, I don't keep it on. And there's just no v digital video stabilization or living images. I just hate this. This is the worst camera app. And if you are trying to unify all of the Windows phones, like previously it was that if you are not owning a Lumia phone, but you are instead owning an HTC or yes belly windows phone then you will not get lumia camera and microsoft is doing a good job at unifying all windows phones together but if you aren't really trying to unify all windows phones then why separate them with rich capture and all that i just don't get it like this thing has no rich capture simply no rich capture all that you can see is the camera rotation, the flash, the white balance, the focusing, the ISO adjustment. I don't know what the hell that is. And oh, exposure. That's it. That's what you get. And it's clearly not like the Lumia camera. This thing is so sluggish. See how it does not take my commands. 
and when it does it's like slow as hell it's just it's just not like the Lumia camera and interestingly Lumia camera is still available in the store and if I go to L Lumia camera is there yes it is there look at this you will never see this icon anywhere else oh wait does it work does this thing work well the answer is no it does not Microsoft is forcing us to actually use Lumia camera come on no, no. yeah see it says a better camera we are saying goodbye to this app for all the great features you're used to and more use camera instead it's already installed and ready to go so Microsoft you deserve this the new camera app which is the camera Windows camera or whatever they're calling it it is the worst camera app in the universe I can say that for sure camera quality deteriorated picture quality deteriorated speed and like everything it's just not Lumia camera I want Lumia camera back whatever the cost anyways too much excitement is not good for my health so let's get into the notification panel you can stop it here or you can pull it down and here you have notifications which have like the full moon where you can see the full message almost for me it's just three emojis <laughs> anyways and you can slide particular notifications off instead of sliding the whole thing off which is pretty good anyways guys so let's go into the settings and show you the bill number see there's a bit of loading there oh come on system and about and here you have the more info and the bill number is 10.0.10586.36 and I'm sorry the last bill I did was 10.586.11 but there was a recent build which was 10.586.29 but it had nothing much to show since I have no helping guides like other YouTube channels and I have only two hands, I'm going to show you how worse the video recording is however I can. I'm sorry I cannot lift up the phone but you will understand what the bug I'm trying to say. So let's start recording. And it's recording in landscape like this, not this. So I'll let it record and I will stop that and then go to the album and the album pops up and weirdly it shows this photo okay so usually the video should just start playing by default I don't know what the problem is and now I have a complete black screen since I tried to play the video so as you can see the photos app cannot play videos how worse is that how worse can Microsoft go I just don't get it I seriously think Microsoft is going off track anyways anybody else having this bug to fix this you have to lock your phone um, unlock it takes a bit of time to load the time and close everything before the video again starts playing and by the way when your phone display is nothing it's still working it still is working yes you can touch you can feel the vibrations from the navigation bars coming right here but it just does not show anything on the screen now 
What about Project Astoria? Guys, Project Astoria that is running Android apps on Windows is dead. It's not coming. Forget it. Not even in near future. Just forget it. Also, another slight animation bug that I've noticed is this. Well, what is the bug, right? I'm going to show you what is the bug. Let's open Adobe Photoshop Express. And I will just hit that and close. And look, the shadow at the back. The shadow at the back is gone. There is no shadow though. Wallpaper is fully transparent. And to prove you that, if I just hold it, see the shadow is back. Worst bug in the universe. Seriously. Worst bug. This is so annoying. It just annoys me to death. Last but not least, all other Lumia apps except for this one. Um, out of focus, yeah. All of the Lumia apps except for the Lumia camera are working. Yes, they are working and are not blocked by Microsoft. Thank you, Microsoft, for doing at least something. Overall, there is nothing much to say. Because there is seriously nothing much to say. This is just a bug fix build and not a new features build. And I'm sorry if I disappointed you or if you did not like this video you can definitely hit the unlike button. Oh sorry, dislike button. And I will be not happy for that. Anyways guys, this is Krish on the Tiki channel signing off from this video. And do hit the like button if you like the video. And I really appreciate all the support I've got till now. So stay tuned for upcoming builds. And by the way, Microsoft has already said that this is the last build till December ends. So be happy and wait for January.